All right, everyone, this is a quick video. I just wanna go over what I think about men wearing dresses. Now, all of these men that are taking photos of them in dresses, that's not counterculture. You know what would be counterculture? It would be counterculture if they said, as a man, they don't wanna wear a dress. That would be out of the norm. That would be rebellious. That would be counterculture to say, no, no, I don't wanna wear a dress. That's where we are in 2021, where it's bad <laughs> to dress the gender that you were born. It's bad to just wanna be a normal, masculine gentleman, apparently. It's bad to be a normal, feminine woman. It's not counterculture to dress up as a woman if you were born a man. It's not counterculture to wear a dress if you are a man. None of this is counterculture. None of this is original. In fact, it's actually just embarrassing. It's embarrassing because you're brainwashed to think it's counterculture. And in reality, growing up, working hard, getting married, having kids, saving, paying your debt off, and living happily ever after as a tight-knit family, that's counterculture. Going to church is counterculture. Believing in God is counterculture. Having faith is counterculture. Apparently, not wanting to inject yourself with an experimental big pharma shot is now counterculture. So the individuals who claim to be anti-government and anti-establishment are the same ones who are obeying everything a handful of politicians are saying. They're the ones that aren't actually thinking for themselves. They're the ones that aren't original in any way. They're just following the crowd because they think it's cool. They support abortion. They don't like church. They don't like religion. They claim to be anti-government, but <laughs> they obey the government at all times. They believe marriage is bad. They claim that masculinity is automatically toxic masculinity, which it's not. They think that wanting to be a mother is a bad thing. It's all just brainwashing. It's funny how, like I said in one of my other videos, around the same time that the internet was developed, where it's very easy to brainwash with propaganda, we have a same generation who's anti everything that's good, everything that makes people happy. They're anti-science. There's people who literally think that men can get pregnant. That's just the result of brainwashing and propaganda. That's all it is. If you are a man and you are choosing to wear a dress to get like likes, nothing that you are doing is counterculture. Nothing that you are doing is original. Nothing that you are doing is unique. Seems like you're doing it because it's the in thing to do. That's not counterculture. That's not original. And that's not unique at all. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I always enjoy reading what you guys think about certain topics. So please go ahead and leave a comment below, like and subscribe and have a wonderful day.